you, thank you. Well, this evening has been organised out of a discussion that I originally had with one of our singers here, um, who said that it was quite difficult for women at this level to build a following from, 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 for a fan base. I thought, hmm, there's got to be something we can do about this. And then the next week, Phonic FM, which is the radio station, community radio station, that I DJ for once a month, said, we need some funds and we need some events organised. And I thought, aha. So we put the two together. I chose my wonderful women and invited them along. And they said, yes, and I'm so grateful for them because they're giving their time for free here today. So our first performer this evening, well, let, let me tell you first, there is no hierarchy here. We've actually decided the, the running order on terms it would be the best flow. So everybody is equally good, you're going to have a good time. The first person up is also our youngest. So she will be leaving after the break because she's got lots of study to do at home for her GCSEs, <laughs> would you believe? Um, Sadie has won the Young Hero of the Year Award with Pride of Exeter last year for her fundraising song that she wrote to raise funds for a holiday home for young people and their families who've been affected by suicide of a close person. Sadie also describes herself as a bit of a festival fairy because she has been gigging, this is her first year, 2015, of gigging, and she's been around just about everywhere she could, Sydney Festival, Exmouth Festival, Wonderfields, and so we're really thrilled to have her here tonight. I'd like you to give a big round of applause for Sadie Horner. Thank you. 